Time to suck All today's right. dick. That's what I'm talking about. That's right. What is up, Killer Collective? Mount Kilimanjaro here, bringing you another Pokey Peasant production. Dun, dun. Oh, shit. Let's fucking go! What is up, Killer Collective? Mount Kilimanjaro here, bringing you another Pokey Peasant production. Today, we're going to open up one of these badass uh, Pokeball tin sets from Sam's Club. Each one of these mini tins has a pack of Evo in it, a pack of Burning Shadows in this, and then a bunch of junk filler stuff. There is some Crimson Invasion in each tin, which I like Crimson Invasion. I think it's underrated. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into it. Let's see what we're like for time. Maybe we'll open something else, too. I don't know. How you guys doing this morning? I'm doing good. Just chilling at work. Trying to get some videos made uh, ahead of time, because I think I'm going to be pretty busy at work. Looks like you've been missing a lot of work lately. I wouldn't say I've been missing it, Bob. <laughs> Next week, I don't know how much time I'm going to have to record. So I figured I'd get some done, make sure I keep in touch with the collective so I can spread them out over the week. Let's go ahead and open up this Charizard tin first. I do love Charizard. I probably sound like a chump when I say he's my favorite Pokemon, but he really is. And it's not because, you know, everybody loves him or because his cards are the most valuable. It's because the cartoon when I was a kid. So if you never watched the Pokemon anime from... 25 years ago, I suggest you do it because honestly, it's just a big piece of history for the, the Pokemon as a whole. And Charizard was kind of a jerk. So Ash found him as Charmander. He's stuck on a rock left there by his trainer to die. Ash saved him and Charmander, you know, warmed up to him, loved him. And then he turned into Charizard and he just kind of turned into a dick. He didn't want to fight people if he felt like it wasn't a challenge for him. Which I can respect that. But yeah, I mean, just the whole story with Charizard is pretty great. So, there's the uh, art card right there. There's a pack of Crimson. Start there. I like Crimson Invasion. I think it's uh, underrated. You know, recently they had Crimson Invasion ETVs at Walmart for $22. And then a lady that worked at Family Dollar told my wife that um, she actually got some for $7 on clearance. And my wife went there and there weren't any there, of course. I mean, if somebody found out they were that cheap, they are not going to last long. So, there's your first code card of the day. Hope you get that Gyarados. That's what we're looking for. That's kind of the biggest Pokemon in this set is Gyarados. There is 124 cards in this set. We want the Rainbow Gyarados GX or we want the Olivia Full Art. The Rainbow Gyarados GX is actually a um, just a rainbow of this card. I'm put it out, try to get that luck going. All right. How about fire? Ooh, fighting. On my continuing on my shitty streak of not being able to guess, guess any energies. It's been a minute since I got an energy right, so hopefully we can break that today. Zuelus, Gastrodon. I like that artwork though. Cool. Peeking red card. I don't know why you're peeking at it, but Swinub, Cacnea, Bunnelby, Shellos, Weedle Gang. That cute little feller. A Ron, Reverse Hollow, and a Gore Geist. I've never seen this Pokemon before. Definitely a Halloween type Pokemon, I guess. <clears throat> Alright, Evo. Kind of an overrated set in my eyes. People love it. I don't know why it's so expensive. I mean, it's got that vintage vibe to it. I know people like that. But uh, yeah, I just don't think the value is there for how much people are wanting to charge for it right now. So I would never pay over retail unless I were getting like a sealed ETB or a booster box. But the booster boxes are like 800, 900 bucks and the ETBs are like 250. So that's never going to happen. XY set, three from the back. How about electric? Oh, fuck, there's no energy. What an idiot. Oh, what a loser. God, why do I do that every time? Did I do four from the back or did I do three? I did three, right? Okay. I don't know why I do that with the damn energy every time. I just don't open enough XY, I guess. The Evolution Spray. Pokedex. 
Porygon, Electabuzz, Vulpix. It's the first Pokemon that, uh, not the first, but Brock got this in the season one of the anime. Sandshrew. There was a Sandshrew that kicked Ash's ass in the beginning. Onyx, another Brock Pokemon. Magikarp, Carp. Coughing, Reverse Hollow, and a Beedrill. This is the same card we got the last time we opened a pack of Evo. Whatever. Oh, yeah, I almost forgot. Um, so, one of my YouTube subscribers, Goblin, I know from this uh, YouTube channel called The Card Economist. Um, it's a live break channel. He asked me, he saw me draw the Gengar for a Terror Shark, and he asked me to draw a Diglett. And I told him I would. So... Let's see how I do. Hopefully it's not a hard Pokemon. Goblin, there you go. What do you think? It's not perfect. His head probably should have been a little pointier on top. Maybe his body might be a little too wide. I also don't like the way his little white spot on his nose turned out. But uh, I was trying to give him a little bit of, of depth, and uh, yeah, I just failed. Depth and stuff are past my skills as an artist, which I don't have any, so... Goblin, I don't know if you wanted this or not, or if you just wanted to watch me draw it, just in case you do want it. Alright, there you go. If you do want this Goblin, let me know. Email me at the same as my YouTube name, Mount Kilimanjelo. Email me at mountkilimanjelo at gmail.com. Send me your address, and I'll mail it to you. I don't know why you would want this, but if you do, I'm down to do that. So, yeah. All right, back to the cards. Let me move this Gyarados because now it makes it look like we pulled it. And we did not. And I don't want fake credit for something I didn't do. I bought that card and another Gyarados for $6. Oh yeah, meme of the day too. Got a lot of extra stuff going on today. Meme of the day, drawing pictures. Yeah, meme of the day. Go ahead and check it out. I think it kind of speaks for itself, so I'm not going to say much. So yeah. Get into this Mewtwo and Psyduck tin. It's kind of an interesting pairing. I'm down for it. There's the art card for it. I don't think these have any sort of value. They're usually all beat to shit on the corners. I hold on to them anyway, because you never know. All right, Crimson Invasion. We already talked about the pulls. I want that Gyarados Rainbow. But it's a green code card, so I'm getting shit. One, two, three, four. At least we could do is get an energy, right? I mean, that would be nice if we could actually guess the energy. It's been a while. Water. Oh! Finally. Peking Red card. Mill Tank. Weird Pokemon. Hakamo-O. 
Houndor. Jigglypuff, Jigglypuff. It's a song Jigglypuff would sing to put everybody to sleep. Execute, Minchino, Numel, Sea of Nothingness, Reverse Hollow, and a Como O. Como O. Como O. Yeah, that's a cool looking Pokemon. That is the evolution of the Hakamo O that we just pulled. All right, Raichu. I'm tired of never getting anything good out of Evo. I'm not saying it has to be a damn Hollow Charizard. I would be down. I would love Mega Cards. Oh yeah, we didn't talk about our chases um, for Evo. Chase cards for the set are the Mega EX Charizard and Blastoise, and the Hollow Charizard. I did see something that looked like a hit there. I think it. Evo card, get that while you can. Three from the back, no energy. Haha, <laughs> I remembered this time. Misty's Determination. Porygon. Devolution Spray. Pika Pika. Growlithe. Machop. Nidoran. Ponyta. Tangela, Reverse Hollow. I'm so nervous, guys. What is it? What is it? What is it? Pidgeot EX. Damn. Quite possibly the worst EX card you can get in Evo. Not even a Mega. I wanted the Mega. That's all right. I'll take it. Let's take a look at the back. It's actually pretty well centered. Might be a little whitening on the corner there. Eh, maybe not. Hmm, that's pretty good. I'll take that. Sadly, this might be the best card I've ever pulled from Evolutions. The secret rares aren't worth shit. That Iwakumi's Doduo or whatever is worth less than a dollar. I'm going to take a drink there. Sorry. All right. Into the Pokeball. There's a coin in there. Oh, yeah, there it is. I don't know what Pokemon that is. We got Sun and Moon Base, Burning Shadows, and Breakpoint. Let's go with the shittiest one first, which is Sun and Moon Base. There is 163 cards in this set. Chase cards are the Lily Full Art, the Rainbow Umbreon GX, and the Rainbow Espeon GX. Alright, how about electric? Ooh, fairy. I always forget fairies in this set, and then I always say that. Timer ball, pinseer, repel, marini. Why are you so mean, marini? Alolan diglet. Hey, we just drew that diglet. What do you guys think? Do you like diglet better without hair or with hair? Because Alolan diglet has that little hair on top. I don't know. I don't know. Dewpider. Alolan Meowth. Growlithe. Poison Barb. Watch out, it's sharp. And Parasect. Next one's XY Breakpoint. So only 123 cards in this set. It is a Gyarados set, just like Crimson Invasion. So we're chasing after the Mega Gyarados EX or the Skyla Full Art Trainer. Gotta get them waifus, right? Green code card, so probably ain't got shit. It's XY, so three from the back. How about electric? Fuck. There's no energy because it's XY? God damn, dude. That's like three times in the past couple days I've done that. Fucking losing my mind. Swana. Stantler. Seems like they're getting a little lazy on Pokemon names in this era. He has antlers, so his name is Stantler. This is a swan, so its name is Swana. You know what I mean? Slow bro. Slow down, bro. Hone Edge. Pancham. Blitzel. 
Staryu, Esper, ooh, Trevenant break card. That's actually a pretty dope. It's one of the doper break cards I've seen. And a Lilligant for the rare. Let's take a look at this uh, break card, though. So that was our pull. Let's take a look at the back. It's definitely a little bit thicker here than on here. But I've never pulled this break card. Break cards really aren't worth much. Depends on, I mean, Lugia is worth more probably than any of the other ones. But yeah, that's cool. I just like the way that one looks. I think it looks dope. All right, Burning Shadows for our last one. All right, there's 169 cards in this set. We are looking for the Rainbow Charizard and the Rainbow Necrozma. All right, how about fighting? Ooh, fairy again. Metapod. Bodybuilding dumbbells. Rhydon. Duskull. Okay. Stuffle. Crab Roller. More low. Gloom, Reverse Hollow. And a Electros, non hollow for the rare. Well, guys, I guess that's it. Another disappointing Sam's Club Pokeball set. You know, if you can find them, it's still a cheap way to get Evo. It's 25 bucks. You get seven packs, two Evo, one Burning Shadows, one Breakpoint, one Sun and Moon Base, two Crimson Invasion. So, I mean, and plus you get the ball in the tins. And my Sam's Club, I think, just recently went out of stock with them. They have been restocking them online occasionally, but then I also heard that Sam's Club's been canceling some orders too. So just something to keep in mind. Definitely not the pulls we were looking for here. The uh, the dry streak continues, honestly. The dry spell, like, it's just been a long time since we, I don't know if we ever pulled anything fire, honestly. So <laughs> I really appreciate you guys watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Goblin, hit me up if you want that drawing. I uh, hope you all have a great day. Thanks, everybody. Enjoy Involving Skies. Bye. Have a great time.